The people who walked in darkness have seen a great light. Christmas is full of wonder. I think the most wonder-filled time is the actual day, Christmas Day. Traditions vary from place to place, family to family, and faith community to faith community. Most honor the holiday with worship and intentional gift giving done in thanks for Jesus Christ, God's gift to the world. My family began the celebration of the Holy Day with supper, followed by the Christmas Eve Midnight Mass. No presents were opened or exchanged until Christmas morning. My mom was clear that we shouldn't be distracted on that special night. I have fond memories of those worship experiences. It was a small church decorated beautifully for Christmas and packed with people. A soft light illuminated the nave with spotlights on the crash scene nestled at the foot of the altar. It was beautiful. The next morning always came early, probably because we were up so late the night before. The new morning illuminated our house and the exchange of gifts. There were gifts under a tree and gifts stuffing a stocking. The stocking was always my favorite. Gifts stuffed inside were never huge, but they were plentiful. Inside I might find anything, a wristwatch, surfboard wax, a cassette tape, a book, or even a sweet, tasty treat. One time I even found a magnifying glass. That glass did much more than just magnify things. In fact, when used carefully, a shaft of light could be tightly focused. So tightly focused that a light bright enough to burn could be created. I believe that's what happened on the first Christmas day. God tightly focused his light and love onto the world, specifically into a manger in Bethlehem. Within the darkness of that first century world, God sent his light and set the world on fire with the birth of Jesus Christ. Let us pray. God, creator of us all, thank you for sending your light into the world. May your light continue to set our souls on fire to do your work in the world. And may it illuminate our paths as we tell others about your love made known in Jesus Christ. Amen.